I'm at hours, I have to switch over the personal convenience, right? If that's what you're, if that's what you typically do. I mean, do. that's what you're saying to me, right? If, if I run out of hours. Do, I'm telling you, I don't care if you're out of time. You should have planned better. Truck drivers. Hear me! Can I have your attention? <laughs> What's good, everybody, and welcome back. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Once again, back in the place to be. It is the Lockout Men Podcast Show. The coolest podcast on the tube right now. What's going on? We're back again with another one. Yes, another one. Another Trucker's Reaction video. And this video right here comes by way of my man, D fucking Nitty. Let me hit a bomb drop for my dude. That's what's up. He was like, lockout man, I got one for you. I was like, what's up, man? What you got for me? Yo, you just did a video. I, I need you to do this one because your boy from across the way did this. I was like, what? Hold on. What boy across the way? What you talking about? Yo, guy, Asian Mai. Can I get a bomb drop for Asian Mai? That's what's up. That's what's up. I said, all right, let me go ahead and look at it. I looked at it. I peeped it out, and I said, yes. Yes, it is time to do a TikTok truckers reaction video to this man right here. So, can you tell me again what you said so I can tell it to my boss? You are parked in a no parking zone. Okay, and you said I can use my personal convenience, is what you said, right? If that's what you're supposed to do, yes, you are not to park here. So if I'm out of hours, I have to switch over the personal convenience, right? If that's what you're, if that's what you typically do. I mean, do. that's what you're saying to me, right? If, that's if I what run you out of hours. Do, I'm telling you, I don't care if you're out of time. You should have planned better. You should have planned to take your break. You knew you were going to have to take a break, so you should have planned to do that. Instead of parking in a no parking zone, where people have wrecked here and been killed because there's people parked here in a no parking zone. And there's no limit for those guys, right? For park in the rest area. Excuse here we have a truck driver being asked by a lady cop to move out of an illegal parking spot. Now, he says that he's in the, what, the rest area? But I think he's on the ramp part of the rest area and if you're on the ramp part of the rest area and it has those big ass no parking signs along that little stretch way right there then bro you are parked illegal illegal why are you giving this little lady a hard time just put your clock in personal convenience and move she's asking you to move without even giving you a ticket but here you are giving her a hard time why why bro why are you giving her a hard time i don't get it i don't understand it man look i know there's there's issues with parking man they says it's a truck shortage but it's not they should say it's a parking shortage because when we get to these truck stops if not if we don't get there on time this bad boys is filled up as well as the what the um the uh rest areas so he's saying that he's being asked to move from a rest area. Bro, you're being asked to move because you're illegally parked. And she says that. Why are you giving her a hard time? Man? So can you tell me again what you said so I can tell it to my boss? You are parked in a no parking zone. Okay. And you said I can use my personal convenience is what you said, right? If that's what you're So, yes, bro, you can use your personal conveyance. Why you not know that? Look, FMCSA has relaxed the rules just a little bit because they should know that us truckers have a hard time finding parking spots when it comes to shutting down. 
You should know this already, my G. Now, maybe some companies, maybe the company you work at, you might not need permission to use personal conveyance, but it is there for you to use. Go into personal conveyance, find you a parking spot, and you're good. So if I'm out of hours, I have to switch over to personal convenience, right? If that's what you're... I mean, that's what you're saying to me, right? If, if I run out of hours. No, I'm telling you, I don't care if you're out of time. You should have planned better. Being planned, shit always happens, little lady. All right? Shit always happens. Yeah, we. I know you guys are going to come in the comments below and y'all going to be like, yeah, bro, man, should have should have planned better. He should have he should have reserved part or whatever the case. But suppose he was held up at a shipper or a receiver or there was an accident on the highway or he was stuck in traffic. Plans sometimes just don't work. Especially early in the morning. When we get up in the morning, we, we trip plan, we figure out. But as the day progresses, yeah, yeah, planning just being thrown out the out the window, little lady. And look, I understand, you know, what the guy trying to say. Yo, I'm on my 10 hour. I can't move my truck or whatever the case may be. But, bro, again... You can go ahead and turn on personal conveyance and move. You should have planned to take your break. You knew you were going to have to take a break, so you should have planned to do that. Instead of parking in a no parking zone where people have wrecked here and been killed because there's people parked here in a no parking zone. And there's no limit for those guys, right? For park in the rest area? Excuse <sighs> Man, come on. Come on, my G. Why why are you making this? Why why are you acting like this is something new to you, bruh? This is not new, man. You know you you knew you parked in a in a no parking zone. You knew you parked illegally. You thought you was gonna get away with it. Unfortunately, the young lady came and she's forcing you to move. So you either move or take the ticket. One of the two. Or both. She probably gave you a ticket and made you move anyway. But no, what you wanted to do, you wanted to get the interaction on TikTok. I I, I don't get it, man. I, I, TikTok, is, it's a new breed of truckers on TikTok, man. I'm telling you, boy. But look, guys, leave the comments in the comments below. If you're a new subscriber, Put new subscriber in the comment and I will res I will respond back to you. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of this interaction right here. Was he in the right? Was she in the wrong? Let me know, man. I mean, like I said, the situation could have been much worse. So you want to know what to help you guys out in situations like this? If you got to find truck parking or whatever the case, download Truckers app, the app for truckers. Yo, you can find any parking spot available if you have this app downloaded to your phone. You can find what truck parking is at a regular truck stop, a mom and pops, a McDonald's. You can even find a freaking field somewhere to find truck parking. Truck parking is the biggest issue right now. It's, it's more so than this driver, quote unquote, shortage, okay? So, brother man, if you hadn't done it already, download Truckers app, the app for truckers. And you want to know what's something else special about this app? Truckers run this app. Truckers would let you know that there's truck parking available at where they at. I'm over here at a pilot. It popped up. Is there is there truck parking here? Some, many, or full. Truckers Path. Download it today.